It's a good cup of tea, sir. Well done. Good. Steampunk enthusiast Joe is in search of an old-fashioned love. Where did you first get a fascination with, uh, yeah, Victorian oh, sci-fi? Victorian things. Um, I think my mum, bless her, she once took me to Whitby, and it just so happened to be Goth Weekend. Now, she would no idea. So at a very young age, one of the first things I remember is all these Victorian people. This is great. I just like the frivolity, you know, I like the bow ties, I've got all the big cravats and the waistcoats and the pocket watch. My, my mum insists that my clothes are a defence mechanism. No, I, I feel comfortable. This is what I feel is most me, you know. It's, it's sort of like warning people that if you get talking to me, it's going to be a bit of a wild ride. Do you dress like this for work? I do, I do indeed, yeah, absolutely. All my kids, wow. I'm a teacher, you see. You're a teacher? Indeed, indeed. At the moment, I'm teaching life skills. One of the lessons I have to teach is sex ed. I found out that they knew a lot more than I did. I walked to class, I'm like, right, guy, you know, we're, we're, I mean, we're here today to talk about sex, and my kids are like, come on, Joe, dress like that. You, you clearly never, you know. I'm like, oh, you've got me, kids, you've got me good. I'd like to meet someone like myself, someone nice, someone bubbly. If I can suggest to someone, hey, do you want to go to an old English Civil War battlefield and wave sticks around like lunatics, and she says, dear God, yes. You know what I mean? I'm like, that's, that's kind of a person I'd like to meet. Are you going to play The Sims? No, I've never oh, played any game. No, of course you haven't, so you won't get... I had all these great Sims jokes. I don't have a strategic mind. You see, neither do I, but it doesn't stop me making the all-important attempt. You know what I mean? It's like, as I said, I'm currently playing through Doom, I spend most of my time looking at the game over screen. My main worry in this life is that people like me, but they don't like me. Like, some people are keeping me at arm's length. My personality is such that people do think that I'm a caricature sometimes, and not everyone wants to know a caricature, if you know what I mean. And I suppose if you were just, like, a bit more of a normal person and you're, like, listening to me talk a million miles an hour, you must be... Um, you know, I'm out of here, you know, check please. I mean, like, I like the role playing on World of Warcraft because that's what I love to do, you know what I mean? Which is why I'm not seen outside my house very often, you know? <laughs> and you ever worry that you went by now? God. I'll put my hand on my heart and say, maybe yes, you know, maybe, maybe yeah. Um, but yeah, no, I'm very, very bad at expressing deep emotions, if you know what I mean. And he says that I need to find someone who I can do that with, but thus far I haven't. And, um, mm. Just because I play art does not mean I'm good. Oh, neither am I good at role playing on it. Um, given that most of my characters have died. Yes. I know you've been sarcastic, but it really hurt. It's my favorite. Oh, oh, you mock me. Maybe scorn is my way of showing appreciation. Is it? Lovely. I'll, I'll take that. I'll pretend. It makes me feel better, so I'll pretend. Um, you know, it's like, it's her way of showing she likes me. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, that's fine. I was going to ask you a sensible human person question. Um, so I was Some gonna... big words there. I, guess. I understand them all separately, but not together. Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.